All right, hi you guys. It is April Hair 101, and I'm here with Randy Furman from Shark Fin Shears, and he is the owner, CEO. He invented all this amazing stuff, but he is going to answer your questions. I asked you guys on Facebook and Twitter what you wanted to know about this company or just about shears in general, and so I'm going to just ask you questions okay. and you get to answer them. Let's go. pick your brain. Okay. Okay. Amazing, <laughs> So from Instagram, Kristen K asks, does Sharpen sharpen your shares when they need it? Yeah, so the answer is yes, Christian. Christian. Uh, Kristen. Yes, her too. Yes, Kristen. Uh, we definitely do. Actually, we're the only shear company in the world. We have a network of certified sharpeners. So uh, when you're ready to, to get them sharpened, you'll call us. We'll let you know if we have somebody in your area. If not, we'll let you know where to send them. And the cool thing is that if that person happens to damage your, damage your shears, which they won't, but if they did, and we can't fix it, we're going to send you a brand new pair for free. So we really, 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 really stand by our products. And the reason we do it is your shears should last you a year or longer between sharpening, and they should last you 20 to 30 years if they're sharpened by a knowledgeable person. 1212 from Instagram asks, other than personal preference or fill, what are the benefits of a longer shear versus a shorter shear? Okay, good. That's a, an easy one. So the longer the shear, remember, remember when you measure a shear, for example, this is a six and a quarter inch. It's not the blade being six and a quarter inches. It's from the tip of the blades to where the finger rest connects to the handle six and a quarter inches. So a six and a quarter inch shear is going to get through the haircut a little quicker than let's say a five inch shear, which might be a half an inch difference in length. Also, if you're doing a blunt cut, a straight line, you're going to get more crisp, clean lines with a longer shear than a, than a shorter shear. Okay, awesome. Okay, this is also from Instagram. It's Natasha Anderson, 20. She says, on average, how long does a pair of shark fin shears last? Thank okay. you, and I love you, Amy. Oh, that's My name's nice. April. But is your name Amy, Natasha? I'm confused. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Natasha, so the answer is our shears, as long as you're checking blade tension once a day, every day, and uh, lubricating the shears after every haircut, you will get a minimum of one year or longer between sharpening. Uh, I'd say our average is closer to two years, and they'll last you 20 to 30 years. Also, what's really important though is making sure you use a good certified sharpener, somebody that knows what they're doing, because you can have somebody really sharpen your shears and they're razor sharp but take 10 years worth of uh, life off of them. Yikes. That's bad, right? Yeah. So use the people that we recommend and we back up that recommendation with a guarantee if they mess them up, we'll replace the blades for you. So here's a question from Ashley Johnson. She says, for a good pair of starter shears, how much should I spend? That's a great question, Ashley. Um, normally, you're going to want to spend anywhere... One fifty to two hundred dollars. Uh, you, you should be able to get a really good quality starter pair of shears. Uh, again, not trying to make this a rah rah shark fin uh, video like a sales pitch, but oh, wow. even yes. our student <laughs> shears, believe it or not, are of professional grade that we give to our students because a lot of students when they graduate can't afford to take uh, to buy a new pair of shears. Not right away. No, nope. sure. and they're embarrassed yeah. to take what they got in school into the mm -hmm. salon. So the answer is approximately two hundred dollars from a reputable company. Definitely from us, you're going to get a lot more than you're uh, than you're paying for. And also with us, you're going to get a free probably blender or uh, um, finisher. Sure. Thank you. Yeah. Awesome. Mabel Allen from Instagram asks, "What metal is best quality for shears, and what metal holds their sharpness <clears throat> the longest?" That's a great, another great question, and we really didn't get a chance to discuss it earlier. Yeah. It could be another video, but um, you know, there's uh, your best steel is going to come out of Japan, okay? And in Japan, uh, there is a factory called the Hitachi Factory mm -hmm. in Japan. So, for example, with our company, from our professional line and higher, it's all Hitachi steel mm -hmm. from from Japan. Uh, and there's something called a rock ball hardness, which is the way they test how hard the metal is. Mm -hmm. So you want to make sure you get these shears with a rock ball of about 56 to 57, mm -hmm. all the way up to about 63. Your shears is about a 62. Cool. Okay. Um, and the harder the metal, the better it's going to hold an edge and it's going to stay sharper longer. However, going back to oil and adjusting, if you don't do the oil and adjusting, I can give you that, that $2,000 pair of, of shears I told you about, the Damascus, and you're going to dull them out in a month. Right. So it's still very important to maintain your shears. Cool. Thank you. This is also a question from Nibolan. I cannot say Nibolan. 
I'm so sorry if I said your name wrong, but you have good questions, so I'm going to ask this one too. <laughs> if you buy shark fins, what is their sharpening policy? Is there something that will void the warranty? Yes. Or, so yes. what is the policy with okay. that? So, and just real quick, our, our, our warranties are as follows. You have a 30-day trial period. Anything you buy, if you don't love them, return them. If you love them, have a big mouth and tell people how great we are. Um, if you keep them, anything ever happens, it's our fault. New pair free. If you drop them, step on them, break them in half, run over them with your car, depending on the model, it's $50 or $100, we'll replace it. Oh. And then the coolest thing is we have our certified sharpeners. So I can run them over and you'll replace it? Yeah, not box. once a week. You know what I mean? We've had a couple people, you know, a couple times a year, all of a sudden they, they're sheer. So you're a little forgiving. You're like, people make mistakes. That's but if right. you're like mistaking every day, that's right. Just get more shit. That, okay. That's not going to happen. Obviously. That's right. But that's really cool. Yeah, it is. Well, again, it's all, for us, April, I'm sure, like you and your viewers, have built good businesses it's always about the customer you don't focus on making money if you focus on doing the right thing the money's going to come right. anyway you know right it takes longer but that's our way to do it no, but yeah really so we have our, our, our network of sharpeners and as long as you use one of our certified sharpeners you'll never void your warranty and you don't have to you can use your own sharpener but if they ruin it it's on you and we're doing this to protect you and your customers cool awesome and you're paying for a sharpening anyway you must right. have exactly the right exactly yeah. right that's exactly that you right. know it's gonna give you a new share if they break them. That's, That's right. cool. And nobody does that. All right, so on Facebook, John Kearney asks, can you buy replacement parts? No, you can't buy them, but we'll give them to you. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's easy, and there's really not many cool. parts because... So if I did take my shares apart, if I got ambitious and was like, take yeah, them yeah. apart to clean them really, really well, and then lost the washer. We're going to send you the washer. We'll like, send you the bumper. Know? Cool. Yeah, we're not going to... I, I don't like, like being nickel and dime when I'm purchasing things. And, Plus, how much is yeah. the washer? Like a third of the cent? Yeah, it's more, more expensive. And we'll even pay the shipping to mail oh, it to cool. you. Oh, cool. That's right. awesome. Yep. Good question, John. Very good. Okay, Mandy um, from Facebook also asked... Mandy Dyke, I think her name is. She says, love my rainbow ones. What are the best way to disinfect them? Ooh, and we answered this in the other video with the link below, but you can answer that again. Okay, if you want. so yeah. the easiest way, Mandy, first of all, you never want to dip your shears into any kind of solution whatsoever. So uh, what April mentioned she does, which is great, is she uses a solution of alcohol, right, with a spray bottle. So you can spray a uh, paper towel, okay, spray it, wipe off the blades. Now you've disinfected your blades. Now here's the real important part. Make sure then you have another paper towel with scissor oil on it. We give you this huge tube, mm -hmm. scissor Comes oil. With the That's right. That's what I love about Put it on the paper towel and make sure you re-lubricate your blades so you don't have metal on metal. Mm -hmm. Because if you don't do that, now you've got raw metal on, on each blade. And every time you open and close the blades, you're taking off microscopic amounts of metal. So it's a great question. Do it after every haircut. You'll get decades out of your shears. Awesome. So that is all of the questions we had on the Q&A. We have a couple other videos, like I said, linked below. Make sure you check those out. Make sure you subscribe and follow Sharkfin Shears on Facebook and Twitter. I think mm -hmm. you're on That's Instagram right. also. Yes, you can go and follow them everywhere and send them all of your love. And make sure you guys subscribe. That is so important because you will get updates and emails. And I think I need to remind you guys also that you don't get the emails and updates on my channel when I post videos unless you go over to the little um, button on the side and click get updates, right? It's, I think it says get updates, but you have to click that if you want to be updated every time I upload a video. So make sure you do that. And thank you, Randy, so much for coming out and doing this Q&A and all this awesome stuff. I am so excited to share this knowledge with everyone. Yeah. All right, you guys, so make sure you go and check out their website, sharkfinshares.com, and they also have a bunch of really helpful videos that are really short and very educational yeah. on how to measure your shears, oil Why are my them, shears pushing them into here? Problem solving, yeah. yeah. And it's at the top, it just says um, how-to videos. So you click on that awesome. link. And uh, they're short, 30 seconds. See, I can handle 30 seconds. Yeah, me too. That's, that's about it. <laughs> uh, we're a little ADD. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but also, if you want to purchase your own share, make sure you use the coupon code APRIL20 and you'll receive 20% off of your order. So that's going to be good for quite some time. We have no plans of taking it down as of right. now. So use it until it doesn't work anymore, which should be a while. That's right. So I am really excited to share with you guys about this company because it's something that this company has just changed my life as far as like the pain in my arm and neck and the comfort when I'm cutting hair and the shears are amazing. So I was really excited to share with you guys um, and they really care about their customers. That's what I love about this company so much is that they have the customer in mind. So make sure you guys are 
educated when you make your decisions because it really does make a difference. So thank you so much for watching you guys. It really means a lot and I love you all. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. And thank you to all our customers as well.